Hey, I need some wallet pictures. So I'm gonna call room room <laughs> of your children. That doesn't sound very really bad. Does it? We are watching Glass Onion and Knives Out Mystery. The first one was just called Knives Out. We currently have 15,428 subscribers at the time of this recording. Requesters, we have. I'm like, that's your phone. Pick up your voice. Our requesters, we have Chase Jones, Julia Guillaume, okay. Uh, Daniel Estrada, RLG, Joel Mayberry, and Shane White. Thank you for requesting this movie. I hope you like it. Shout out to our patron, Get My Wigs. We appreciate you. Are we promoting? Are we promoting? Get My Wigs. What you got? That's literally the username on the Patreon. Okay, I'm assuming they got a wig. No? On sound, we got Chase New, Morgan New, Wallen. That's my shit. Chase and you. Did you know? Maxwell singing Pretty Woman was a cover of Kate Bush. No, like that's her OG song. She sang it. She she did what she could, but Max, that's Maxwell's song. No, no it's not. Yes, it is. You listen to them two songs and tell me whose song it is. Okay, I can't do it. Well. <laughs> no, you can't. You're right. You can't. <laughs> I can't do it. <laughs> Would you rather have strong legs or strong arms? Don't skip um, leg day. Leg. Don't skip leg day. You're going to be out here looking like chicken little. Would you rather never get tired or never get hungry? Never get tired. Never get tired. You know, some vampire. Nah, me too. Never get tired. Would you rather hang glide or skydive? I'm going to go. Mm. That's when you got the little, the little, you got the, you on the kite, right? Yeah. <laughs> you on the kite. <laughs> Not no kite. You on the big ass kite holding on him. You. I'm gonna go kite, kite, because I'm gonna try to fly. I'm gonna yeah. go skydive. I'm gonna go hang glide. Skydive with the parachute, right? Mm -hmm. mm. Would you rather bowl a perfect game once or a consistent game always? What does that mean? Like you always get two. So, whatever you bowl now is what you're gonna now? keep bowling. Now? Yeah. Let's go now. I'm gonna go consistent. Consistent. What do you bowl now? I'm so good. Straight. That's not the question. Straight, straight. Yeah, there's. <laughs> no. <laughs> it depends. I haven't been in a while because last group I went with, they weren't that fun. So that means your bowling sucked because of Yep. Was... It was like, okay. I think you blame it. It's your turn. Your consistent. Can we wrap it up? But when you were, you know, the right group, they'd be like, eee. I think you blame your like, consistency. Eee. Genius always looks like insanity at first, though, right? Isn't that how it became Miles Braun? You guys have no idea. The man faxes me in the middle of the night. Uber for biospheres. Whatever. Okay, maybe. What AI and dogs equals discourse. Remember child equals NFT? We all laughed, but then the Crypto Kids app paid for this building. This is science, not a religion. Remember that, Lionel. Because if your name is on this and it fails, it will sink you forever. Lot going on. They're getting it popping. Not the fire dancers. What they called? Flame twirlers. I don't like that. Nah, they go. Please stop fire spinning inside. Didn't I say it? Fire spinning. You said twirl. Oh. No phones. Why can't she ever phone? Because she's afraid. That I will tweet an ethnic slur. 
Yeah, you can have your phone. Yes. What's in it? Are you right, a genius? What is this thing? Well, it's a Miles invitation. Well, duh. But I mean, what is it? It's like a. It's just like a block of wood. Okay. How do you open this thing? Hi. How do you know they got one? Miles on two. Hi, Peg. Oh no, Peg's putting out a fire. She'll be back. <laughs> Another fire? Kurt, should you really be having a party? No, they're all in my pod. It's fine. Has anyone heard from Duke? So this has gotten some attention recently. So obviously, I would like to speak to this. And the answer is no, Jimmy Kimmel. Yeah. Do not hate boobs. Oh, wait, it's too She got crystals on it. Hey, what is this thing? My mom already broke it. It's a stereo brand. She did something to it, it opened up. I don't know if she broke it. Were those the same? Magic eye things? Sorry. What in the Jumanji? Damn, you got some money if you said color maybe or size. Wait, wait, the tapper thing is from Morse code. The X's and O's are dots and dashes. This and does. Maybe you want to be in a puzzle? Our next move. It's a compass. Ma. It's a compass. Okay, North. Mom need to be on the rotation because you know. Hey. It's music. Guys, it's music. It's music. Are you mocking me? Yes. Okay. Ha ha. Hey. This is Boss Little Fugue in G minor. It is a beautiful musical puzzle based on just one tune. And when you layer this tune on top of itself, it starts to change. Oh, 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 oh. This would be really cool if I wasn't scared right now. Hey, they just playing. It, the message is gonna be like, if you're reading this, I'm dead. Right. Something simple. I'm yeah. gone. Oh, oh, oh. Figure it out. She just doing all this around together. all these people. One, two, three. My worry is for Leslie. He don't only want to loan. My dear friends, my little disruptor is my closest inner circle. And I hope your puzzle solving skills are wetted. <gasps> because you will also be competing to solve the mystery <gasps> of my murder. I feel like they've only on. heard a section of the letter and not the my murder part. Yeah, they ain't really. They thinking it's uh, a clue uh, reenactment. She excited to go. Oh. How you doing, girl? Oh, Did she figure it out? And she, she sad. She look a little sad. How come you ain't get a call? They was real sure to get Duke. Oh, Ooh, you know what, bitch? I ain't mad at it. He put goggles get on it. and everything. Oh, not Among Us. But who didn't play that in in quarantine? I saw you go in the engine. Is that Kareem? Mm -hmm. I've got to say, the world's greatest detective. I thought you'd be better at this. <laughs> I think maybe this game's just not my thing. And I appreciate what y'all trying to do for me here. Yeah. We're worried about you, buddy. Lockdown hasn't been easy for any of us. But Philip told me you haven't left the bath for a week. Oh, that's how pervy. You gotta be real prony. <laughs> hey. I lose it. Hey, you gotta relax. Like I need. Great case. Oh, I have fun. Someone here for you. To the ball. Benoit Blanc. Oh my God. Benoit. Are you Benoit Blanc, the detective? I'm pretty sure your girl ain't getting the invite. <laughs> she coming though. Crew. Why are you in Greece, Mr. Blanc? I was invited by Miles Brown. Say with Miles? No, never met. Ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Greece. But first, I'm going to need you to remove your, your mask, mask and extend your tongue. This will only be momentarily uncomfortable. Uh, I'm okay. <laughs> Mr. Cody. What the oh, fuck you shooting in the mouth? This trip's here, the first new person he's ever invited. Why are you even putting the mask on? Oh, Donna, tell me you ain't see people like that. What is that? What is that? Yeah. Okay, please. Now, what is that? She got that Mary J. Blige look. Look. Little soup. Not the. Oh my god. Okay, you got your assistant with you. Y'all did something to her, huh? Mm hmm. Y'all excluded her. Yep, they excluded her. What y'all do? Y'all scared, huh? I could not help but notice a stir of her arrival. Yeah. And they're no longer pawns. One legal move would cut her out completely. Damn. But he's still invited to this weekend? The question is why he invited. Why is she so 
Are we allowed to hug? I've been holding men in black. We can hug. Oh, men in black. Oh, look at it. Oh, look at it. Oh, whiskey. Wow. I just I love that necklace. Oh, oh, that's, that hug a little long. You didn't give it a box? Andy. Who? You're here. I am. We got a great weekend. Just our gang. Just us. Hey, hey. <laughs> hey, bro. Kurt. That's Daryl. He's he's just staying here. He's going through some things, but he's not part of the experience at all. Who's gonna bring them bags? Cause y'all don't look like you. you Should we um, get all bags? Though? Right. No, they don't. They Someone don't. will get them for so. I'm gonna take my own bag. I'll You're just leave my. I'm Andy. That is very genial, Lord. I'm fan wall. It's like an actual huge glass onion. Yep. Past, present, and future. Look, I sent everyone home. I just want to have a normal weekend with my old friends like the old days. Right? I mean, see, look, that's the thing. The fuck is that? This isn't just a rich asshole house. It's, I just, it's not even a house. Amazing. You're just not going to walk past this oh. like that. He don't got no step, that's why. Oh, what is that? That's the hourly dong. Hey, Andy. I, I really am glad you're here. This isn't like weird to y'all. Hell yeah, it's weird. It was weird when he said, "Open up." <laughs> yeah, yeah, did. Okay, you're good. I'm just making sure that we we all. I ain't there. This is not my dream. In the same room. Is that a mobile call? Oh yeah, that's my baby blue. It's one of a kind. It goes anywhere I go. What are you doing here? Uh, uh, you invited me. No, I didn't. You sent me a box. We didn't actually see the, see the box. box. Yes. Somebody hired him. Somebody gave him the box. What if it was her? What if she fixed the box and gave it to him? She ain't fixed that box. She fucked that shit. Hang on. Someone reset the box. Someone reset the box. They sent it to you as a gag. I've got the predefinite detective in the world at my murder mystery party. That is so legit. Thrilled to have you. I mean... Relax. My mama said Enjoy don't invite yourself, yourself nowhere if you wasn't already hey, in the plans. Try to solve the murder mystery if you can. So somebody's got to die. Are we are we all on the same page with that? Do we think it's going to be Miles? Do we think he's going to fake his death? Mm. Look at this pool. I think I'll go for a swim. Okay, Neutrogena commercial. Neutrogena's for your face, not for your hair. <laughs> she came out like this. Hey, Blanche, have a dip. Uh -huh. yeah, Why is there a little car? That's the ice chest. Over. I, bet it, hard. I bet it moves. You remember the night you almost pancaked me with it on the road outside of Anderson Cooper's birthday? <laughs> it feels so low. What are y'all drinking? Oh, you really do? go everywhere with that thing? <laughs> really? You never know when shit's gonna go down. Are you not with friends? In the pool? All right. Oh, y'all keep keying in the corner. What y'all talking about? Oh, they definitely smash it. We all agree? Duh. Okay. Jerk. Maybe before. Well, it looked like they got some plans this weekend. But we gonna, everybody got motive. Ooh. Silent type. Andy. Hi. Is, is that a fax machine? <laughs> Miles doesn't even have a phone. So it's an eclectic bunch. Uh, I think disruptors recognize each other no, no, yes you, you've used that word before you're sitting next to birdie J. she was a fashion icon and then the youngest editor ever of shishi magazine right shishi? then there was the whole thing with the halloween costume oh. it was a tribute to beyonce but people did not take it that way mm -hmm. she comes out with designer high quality comfortable sweatpants just as a pandemic hits she disrupted her own disruption she made a killing you think they saw the first influencer to have a million followers on Twitch? Yes, I did. That's what that's what I did with Alf. Yeah, I say it. What we did with Alpha. You start with something small. You break a norm or an idea or a convention, some little business model, but you go with things that people are kind of tired of anyway. That's the place where you she have to look within yourself. She gonna crap. And ask, am I the kind of person who will keep going? Somebody gonna break because your at glass that on you. point, People are not gonna be on your side. They're gonna call you crazy. Nobody 
once you break the system itself. But that is what true disruption is. Okay. You gave wow. that speech. Yeah. Mm. That was some real red pill stuff, Miles. <laughs> <laughs> You're a detective, right? Yes. Can you spot the other thing? The real thing this group has in common. Everybody knows who Lionel works for. That's no secret. And we know who bankrolled Claire's campaign. Nobody would touch Bertie with a 10-foot pole because she went on Oprah and compared herself to Harriet Tubman. That's Miranda. Every single one of you was holding on to dear life to Miles Bryan's golden titties. Titties. And each of you, <laughs> you'll stab a friend in the back to hold on. Mm. My, she relate to Harriet Tubman. On yeah, she know, she's doing a lot of extra stuff. Something's off. What do you mean? You think she's drugs? She's changed. Duh, y'all hurt her. Bird showed me the statement that you wanted to make to the press about Bangladesh. And if you make her go through with it, her name is destroyed. You gotta get her to make that statement. It is her only way out. Not the butt cheeks. <laughs> okay. What is this cross flip off? I like the bucket hat. I thought she was saying I like the butt cheeks. Yeah, I thought she was too. <laughs> I like the booty cheeks. You run with the gun too? Is it just in his... Oh, don't shoot it off now. <laughs> hey. hey. He's man. running with it. Well, you look shocked. She was all he, up over him. That hug alone. He's shocked. He finna start shooting. So everybody got a motive against mine. Hmm, I don't think 16. He likes it heavy on the piece. Are you me? Is this my Cuban breeze? Are you treating her like, is that the girl from Iron Fist? Oh, mm -hmm. that's uh, Jeremy Renner's small batch hot sauce. Hey, Andy. Pick your poison feels very literal. In this I'm movie. hoping it's still whiskey soda. Nope. I mean, this, this place is the Tate Modern. Not the Mona, Mona Lisa. Lisa. Hang a framed print of the Mona Lisa front and center. It's like having a Che poster in your dorm. Wait. That's impossible, Miles. Mm -hmm. Forgive my incredulity, but surely, uh, you know, the, the Mona Lisa, it's, that's property of the state. This. You know, it turns out the transport and the security is most of the cost. Check this out. Oh, my God. Oh my God. I had a little override button installed. Oh, Where do you, you think did. it is? <laughs> what did I say to you guys? The first night that we hung out in the Glass Onion, what did I say? I want to be responsible for something that gets mentioned in the same breath as the Mona Lisa. Forever. I've invited world leaders and members of the press from all over to come to this island. And right here, I'm going to unveil the future. You know what this is? You know damn well we do. It's a bomb. That's a new solid hydrogen fuel. It's incredibly powerful. It's radically efficient. Zero carbon emissions. And it's derived from abundant seawater. Claire and I are not going to be responsible for putting something out in the world before it's tested and... Uh-uh. You, you're running this entire place off this? All of it. I'm out of touch. This is reckless. You're going to get somebody killed. Oh, you're not getting out. It's already happening. In this very room, a murder will be committed. My murder. Consider what you know about each other. Know that across the island I've hidden clues. Some may be helpful, some may misdirect. That's for you to determine. Tell me how they achieved the murder. And most importantly, what was the motive? Miles died by suicide. That person. Come on guys, throw out predictions. Miles, Miles dies uh, by his own creation. Yeah. That's literally what I said, you guys suck. This will take the whole weekend. You know, this is truly delightful. Yeah, why not? As Watson said to Holmes, it was Bertie who planted a remote device on the crossbow in revenge for you stealing her signature red diamond. Look at the secret arrangement. It triangulates Bertie just perfectly with that thing, which is loaded with a dummy vault. That is a vintage Jayhawk brand crossbow. Jayhawk, Bertie J. Mr. Braun. Uh, the large pendulous locket, which has uh, not left your neck. <laughs> ah! My red diamond. A dramatic, passionate, and 
colorful crime for a fashionista, Miss Birdie J. I will be mad. God, that's just... I hired Jillian Flynn to write the whole thing. Oh, she's quite good. She's goddamn expensive, is what she is. Truth is, I, I, I ruined your game on purpose, and for a very good reason. I'm sorry, what? Chris, it's taken seven people, each of whom has a real life reason to wish you harm, gathered them together on a remote island. It's like putting a loaded gun on the table and turning off the lights. He sketched out the original idea for Alpha on a cocktail napkin and showed it to Andy one night at the Glass Onion. Andy used to tell me the truth. Nobody does that now. <laughs> you know, you could just power it down. You know, uh, it could just say up. That's why I think you guys whiskey, sports, I like general interest. You believe me to talk about the elephant in the room? Mm. Just gonna throw a blanket over it and push through the weekend? Am I the elephant? Yeah! You're the elephant! <laughs> Nothing about any of this is fair. Congratulations, now you know. And we all stuck with Miles. You did fine. You got yours. No, he Are you gonna slap her for me. All of it. Just tell us the right words that we can use so that we can get on with our lives. You want revenge? You want to slit Miles' throat? Say it! I want the truth! I want the truth. Not Mona coming up on the truth. The truth is, is that we are all holding on to that gold. We're all playing the same game here, honey. Honey? You lost. You just come back. You're the loser. There. That's the truth. Detective, your next assignment is who killed the party? What's that? Come on, guys. She took his gun. My yep. games, okay? Hey, Alpha DJ, give us something upbeat. This is uh, all over the internet. You know those numbers? It's fire. It seems right now. That's sure does. <laughs> Guys, have I ever let you down? I'm getting overstimulated. Pull through, hold it off. Not that dawn. You stay. He's in the middle. The lights are gonna go out. Bang! Or somebody poisoned his drink. They just handed him a drink. Something needs to happen. I owe genius. I love you. On your feet, genius. I want to see your. Yeah, he handed him that drink. Now she gotta hide the gun. Oh my god, oh my god! Would you call your boat and have him come here? Oh my god. Oh my god. Mr. Braun. Notice how his phone stopped after well, he died. What if it is Miles? He's trying to clean up everybody so he don't. You know what I mean? I thought his, his cups were just all said, you know, his last name. Kill me. Miles! One billion? Look at you. <laughs> and arrest somebody. I was gonna do it for free, but. Where's Whiskey? Where's Andy? Where's Duke's phone? It just dinged. It's. Good about his phone, look. Where's his stupid gun? Mr. 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 Brown. Oh, it's all right. It's just that Howie Dong thing. Oh no. My murder game. We were going to be having drinks, and I thought it'd be fun to say something dramatic just at 10 o'clock, and then we were going to have 20 minutes where. What happens at 10 o'clock? Oh. Gunshot! Gunshot! Dang. Gunshot! I'm not going to lie, I would be screaming to him. <laughs> yeah. I'm in the corner like, oh, oh fuck. It was Andy! It was Andy! She killed Duke and she tore her room apart! I saw her! What? <laughs> oh hell I'm it's every man for himself i'm, I'm locking spot. myself I'm in the closet shit i might make a run for it on the grounds nah andy stay your ass away because the lights just went out and she just hear everybody looking for her that's a bullshit
That's some. That's some. They coming for you, bitch. Who you rooting for? Andy. <laughs> <laughs> what are you talking about? That's Janelle Monae. What you talking about? Oh, a knife is missing. A big one too. The big gets. <laughs> <laughs> it's her. her she did it. <laughs> no, I'm grabbing a knife for myself. Oh, you got some gloves on. Where's Daryl? It's all in plain sight. We only need one last piece of information, but only you can do Whoa. Damn. You ain't gonna question she just got shot through that glass that glass room and how you know where to come? I mean y'all all heard it. I, I, I don't know. Maybe I have trouble hearing where stuff comes from. Only one person can tell us who killed Cassandra Brand. Cassandra? Her name Cassandra and we calling her Andy? Did I help you? Yes, is, is this Benoit Blanc's residence? Blanc? There's someone here for you. With a box. My name is Helen Brand, and I came all the way here from Alabama. Well, Twin what sister. do you do in Alabama? I teach. Mr. Blanc, two days ago, I received a call. My twin sister committed suicide. You know, when we were kids, we goofed together, and we do this character, Rich Bitch. Rich Kevin. Bitch? The dog ate the caviar again. Mm. <laughs> you get the call. Yeah, yeah, I get the call. How long ago did she die? This was yesterday. And then I, I go to Andy's house. I'm cleaning it out. And then I just hear a knock at the door and it's some carrier. But this thing, for miles from her. And I'm sure there's some clever way to open it. I don't know. I just open it. <laughs> she's an invitation. Andy didn't commit suicide. Mm. She didn't leave any note. She sent this 4 p.m. the day she was murdered, four days ago. I'm giving you all one last chance to make things right. You know where to find me, hey. I searched every inch of every room in her house, and guess what wasn't there? Sleeping pills. That red letter, Donna. The red on glove. Wait a damn minute. You want to hire me to go to that island? Oh, I got no money. This is a stupid idea, right? Listen, I want to be clear, huh? I'm not Batman. <laughs> <laughs> I've right. not seen your sister death in the news. Did, did you release a statement? No. Shit, was I supposed to? <laughs> I'm proposing that you come with me to that island as your sister. Now, why would anyone suspect you showing up playing your sister when they don't know your sister is dead? One of those shitheads killed my sister. Hey, Donna, I would be there, but I ain't getting shot. <laughs> right at the top. Drink? You need a drink. Oh, no, I don't drink. I'll have some coffee. All right. On the boat, yeah. be cold. Hmm? Don't engage in conversation. Okay, I'm not great on boats. Oh, you'll be fine. Just remember, rich bitch boys have motives for each of them to want Miles Braun dead. Now, why would they kill her to protect him? Just don't get it. What about Miles? Yeah. Miles Brown is not an idiot. The risk committing murder after a very public court case, with the possibility that that email of Andy's coming to life would be an exceedingly stupid thing to do. Ten years ago, before they all made things, they used to hang together at this bar. I thought that Miles was leader of the pair. No, Andy was. They were all friends with Andy. Then she found Miles, introduced him to the group. This is Miles. Oh, I'm, 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 I'm pissed. I bought your ass. Nobody liked him. And then the big thing happened. That was in. It was in the, the bank. Yeah. What's that you working on? Miles' aspirations keep getting bigger and bigger. Cut to two years ago, Miles meets some sketchy Norwegian scientist at an ayahuasca ceremony in Peru. This is it. No, no, no. This is not a startup. This could blow up the world. Yeah. No. Literally, Miles. This could blow up the world. I won't. And I'll take half the company to stop you from using it for this. And she did. Her whole case was based on intellectual ownership of the company's founding idea. Her idea was an napkin. Miles was very excited. He had an idea. Fuck y'all. Uh, so he grabbed a napkin. Miles. Uh, it was Miles. Miles. Weak. Lion ass. <laughs> Look at it. girl. I can't see. <gasps> you 
god, the napkin. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. This is your last chance to back out. You got a bulletproof vest for me? Because this, this dude over here mm. carrying a gun. Ballsy move. You shouldn't be here. Where were we here for that? Oh, we were up there with uh, with them. When we're all settled in, Brown's gonna pull me aside to explain my presence. That is your chance to snoop. Andy. Yes. Ah. We didn't really meet. Do you want this? No, this way. It smells like that guy Daryl. That's a beautiful necklace. She handed Look. it to Peg. Swords? Yeah. Um, Miles got it from me. I think it's really shitty what they all did to you. And how they all treated you. I read your court transcripts and you got shanked. Oh, here's the pool. We're gonna walk around a little longer. I'll catch you over here. Hey, it's really great talking to you this week. Me too. I did it. Two weeks ago, I did it. Yo, let's keep Kim. You signed off on the power plant. Yep. Oh, God damn it. God, I just pray that Andy was wrong about this clear stuff. Now she was right. I was the one in magazines. He was nobody. What did she toss me? It was this little thing in my hand. I prefer that. Bitch. You're really good at this. This is interesting stuff about whiskey and motives for both Ronald and Claire. You know, they've come to apologize, to make amends. And the murder itself, it's non-violent. They don't even see her die. <laughs> she just goes to sleep. Whoa, 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 whoa. I thought you said you didn't drink. Oh, this is a drink. This is some... Funky stuff. No, you that. That's why she was stumbling. It's time to push. No, 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 no. <laughs> We're not pushing anything right now. Listen, I feel good. I think maybe you should lie down. We're running out of time, Block. Hell. That's why she was running like that. <laughs> 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 I had to run it the same way when I'm drunk. Wait. 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 No. You wait. That day in court, you couldn't even look me in the eye. You would talk about the email. So now you want to talk about the email. You didn't even write back. That's why I called. <laughs> we all did. Right after we got it, over and over. And when we couldn't reach you, I went to your house. Lionel and I got there at the same time. Bertie came back later on to check. It was the same thing. Where the hell were you, Andy? What time did you get there? I don't know. It was dark. You were already there. He almost got in an accident on his motorcycle. He was driving so fast. If I would have answered the door right now, would you have said, I'm sorry? Or were you just showing up so you could stop me from using that envelope? Man, I like this. I think maybe you should take a drink and you're just killing it. Lionel and Claire were never there. But Duke came early. Get that check, Serena. I don't hear for it. We don't have a motive. Oh, I don't like that. Or so either you two want to do a session or what? You, you, you was live? <laughs> same, same. I mean, God damn, girl, you scared me. From that afternoon, just minutes after Andy sent the email. Lionel, Lionel Buxton. Now hold on, it doesn't necessarily mean it. Just, yeah, we really need this. So do this for me one last time. Not the Illuminati on his chest. Alright. Hello. Oh, so he was putting her up to. Oh, I didn't think he was calling her. I am building the future of news. I can't have Lionel Horn Boner Phil Karma in the mix. He's my loyal friend, but I can't put him on Alpha News, okay? I'm done. Don't. You can't talk to me. Wait. That's when she goes. Oh, bitch. I am going to sign the statement. No, that will destroy us. Sorry, no real quick. What is this? My secret phone. <gasps> the proposed Bangladesh factory is notoriously one of the world's biggest sweatshops. Please advise. Wow. And then you replied, Okie dokie. Sounds perfect, thanks. Cause Please tell me you did not think sweatshops are where they make sweatpants. Sweatpants. Miles is gonna pay me off. He said if I take full responsibility for the sweatshops, they'll pay me the value of my shares. 30 million. Did he know? 
They all had a motive to protect Miles. They were all there that night. So what now did it? The envelope. I mean, we were just destroyed it. They were wanting to see what they'd done to him. They brought it. So, we did it tonight. Andy, I'm hoping it's still whiskey soda. You need to keep your head clear and stay sharp. <laughs> he said, don't drink that. Pick a fight and lose. We have to find that envelope. You're a loser. Search their rooms. Ransack her. Fast and thorough. <laughs> It released. Andy? Duke? I let Duke because I couldn't. He didn't deserve this. Yes, he did. Okay? He is a bastard. I don't feel sorry for him. He deserved what he got. And you are better off without him. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. I told you to leave his ass. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> oh, geez, that was a gun? <laughs> yeah. I thought it was a big ass back scratch. <laughs> what? It looked like a four prop vest. Ma'am. That was a gun! Why are you running right looking back? Did you take Duke's gun? Why would I take Duke's gun? Did you find the envelope? No, I searched every room, it's not there. Oh, I've been a fool. Upstairs. There's one more room to search. Yeah, the onion. We only need one last piece of information, but only you can. Goddamn. Them sandals, girl. You should have been running. What's that movie she in? Antietam or something? I saw blood. Yo, journal. Ooh. Damn, my was the way to go, I see. Where the hell are you gonna get blood from? Who saw her? They still there, right? No, they dropped the gun as soon as they oh, shot her, remember? The hot sauce. Ah. I hope that shit don't be burning. It looked like it was hot, hot. You have to find that envelope. Oh, no, give me that. <laughs> give me that back. <laughs> That's what we did. Oh, damn. That's burning. Damn. Oh, he committed. He committed. That's burning. Worse than I'm there. You better hope that don't roll down. In her mouth. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, shit. Not the nose. I mean, not the eyes either. Oh. <laughs> 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 we can't this ridiculous game that started well before we set point. We all caught up. Well, you explain it to us all then. Well, I keep returning. In my mind, to the glass of it. I expected complexity. I expected intelligence. I expected a puzzle, a game. What you looking at? Let is, me look. It doesn't hide at all. <gasps> I was staring right at it. What it teased my brain through this entire case. You got a gun when you caught this shit out. Ingredient. Can we just take a second and fully abbreviate this moment. It's not a real word. It kind of sounds like one, but it's just entirely made up. It's Reclaimed. The predefinite detective. A veritable minefield of malapropisms. The infraction point. And factual errors. He didn't write the mystery. It voila. It all adds up to the key to this entire case. And it was staring me right in the face. Because he's a dumbass. Miles Braun is an idiot. Yeah, look at that picture. Yeah. Oh. Please, just tell us who tried to kill me. He must have picked it up by mistake, you told us, right mm. after it happened. Look at that dress, Ben. Pretty, pretty. Do that again. Yeah. What did y'all actually see? Wow, look at that dress, Ben. Pretty, that's amazing. Just, just. You handed Duke your own glass. Why? Because the night Andy sent you all the emails, when Duke got to Andy's house early on his motorcycle, he saw Miles leaving. He told all of us, right out in the open, he told us. Iconic. You remember that night you almost pinched me with my road outside of my hand? It's Duke's birthday. And Miles had been living in Greece the past six months. No. Whiskey. Miles <laughs> saw you on your birthday in New York. Gave you that necklace for your birthday. 
and the sweatshops and the consensual cocoa liquid cable news assignments. Sorry, what? And focus on the envelope. He's seen two ghosts. Learn facts and email to Miles, who received it in New York. The one thing that could destroy his empire lies, the truth. So Miles drives his baby blue Porsche to see the crowd, and Andy lets him in. Of course she did. Well, she was clever enough not to fear Miles. And she didn't see the real threat, the obvious threat, until it was too late. Not him planning a murder mystery party oh, two weeks after he murdered somebody. But he didn't know Andy was dead. No, no, he didn't know that until this evening. Right here, when he got a Google alert on his phone. Right out of the open, Duke showed him. It's interesting, right? It sure does. It's so much stupider than that. It, I am a shot. Buddy, what do you think we didn't see all Cuban greens? Oh, God. which I have to give you credit for, did have a sound foundation of thought. Furthermore, you have a loaded gun conveniently within reach. It's like putting a loaded gun on the table and turning off the lights. Which actually happened. Yes. You did with it. <laughs> Brainless. And you stole the whole idea from me. You recognize this? Andy's hammer. How could you ever prove that that's the original? The bar closed nine years ago. And hers has one thing that Joey just doesn't. It has the, the glass the onion on yeah. it, yeah. Now okay. put it away before he uh, ruined it. Second. Son of a bitch! This will not stand. Uh, well, did you see this proof? This smoking napkin blanc? No. Did anybody? Are y'all still bitches? Okay. <laughs> he didn't kill her. He tried to kill her twice. Wow. And in the real world, you need more than a neat little detective story. You need evidence. Not if I recorded this whole conversation. Right. She recorded this whole conversation. Tell me you recorded it. Test the cops. It's going to be your word against mine. How do you think that's going to go? I think it's going to go about like it went for Andy. Fuck you. Y'all ain't gonna say shit? No, honey, stepping up? Mm-hmm. Up. Uh. Raise your hand and say, I saw him get you gun. Y'all some bitches. I saw the napkin before he burned it. We did. I'm locking all y'all's eyes up. We, we did. I'm sorry, Ellen. I gave you the truth. This is when my jurisdiction ends. I don't believe this. Offer you some courage. A reminder of why your sister walked away in the first place. Oh shit. Ba boom! Yeah, bitch. Things about to get real. Y'all got that? Ba boom! I'm smashing shit. Bow, bow, bow. What you gonna do about it? Nobody sees me. Why is it the Mona Lisa thing? She doing it too slow. I'm sure there's some satisfaction, but I want boo, 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 boo. You know? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> fuck you. I know. Fuck you, everybody. Fuck you. Fuck your husband. Fuck your kids. Fuck your dead boyfriend. Fuck your hat. Fuck you. Really? Nah, fuck them. Y'all don't want to say nothing about the truth, but you yeah. want to fuck some shit up? <laughs> fuck you. Hit them. Oh, oh, oh. I think that belongs to the garage. Okay, okay. Not all this crystal. Uh huh. Ooh. We're not. Yeah. This whole shit gonna blow. None of them think to leave the room. Oh. That's your fault. <laughs> Girl, wait, you'll your notebook in there. Walk away. Mm -mm. Yeah. Mm -mm. 
reminder of when my sister walked away in the first place. Yeesh! Oh, shit. Fuck y'all! But girl, get out! What the fuck? To the glass <laughs> Baby blue done blew up. <laughs> mm -hmm. They gonna get your ass for that. She a runner, she a track star. What is Absolutely. with this cross? Like, Whoa. Wakanda forever. It's a big fucking you. you didn't, you didn't hear that story? Yeah. Blow it up, Steve. Okay, now get the fuck out. Right, we gonna get out here, right? I don't care. You think you fuck me like the gangster? No. Because it accomplished nothing. Shut up before I push you down. The reveal of the future just barbecued. The world's most famous pain, dumbass. Right. And you did get your wish. To forever be remembered in the same breath. That's the Mona Lisa. That's the Mona Lisa. Hey, remember that one guy who burned down the Mona Lisa? <laughs> yeah, that's him. I saw the napkin he burned. Oh, great. I saw him drive away from Eddie's house the night she was killed. Y'all just a bunch of liars. I know. It don't matter now. Yeah, that, that was one thing I was going to say, too. Like, it's cool that she got, got him back. I mean, is it really getting it back, though? Because like you said to your point, like, well, you don't get your sister back. You don't you know get your saying? sister back, which is a big, that's, no, that's, that's top. That's top number one, all right? But to what she can't, because you can't bring back the dead. She can't have that. But what she can have is knocking this dude off his damn pedestal because yeah, he out here with the fucking Mona Lisa in his little glass onion, the biggest fuck you have ever. Like, that shit got to go. You can't just Edward Norton. I never remember his name. Um. That's, it's like, no, you can't be living on your high pedestal having your goddamn car on the fucking roof because there's nowhere to drive it on this private fucking island, but it goes everywhere you go on this crazy bullshit. No, you can't have all that. You need to reap what you, what, reap what you said. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, you gotta get, you gotta Same get got. I mean, that's just, that's deal. just how, that is how I feel in just life in general. Like, it's gonna come back to you. How you treat people gonna come back to you no matter what. Absolutely. So that, just to see that, was was really good. One thing that they do really well in these movies, man, is that they do a really good job at masking everything. They do these movies really, really well. Like, this is crazy how good this movie is. And the little hints that just go over your head until it's like, wow. Yeah, exactly. It's, it's, it's like, man, yeah, Remember when you almost pancaked me with that? No comments about all the times I missed something because I was talking. <laughs> Uh, yeah, like, I missed that. I missed like, this story. The pineapple part. I missed that. That pineapple part was crazy. Like, just for it to come back to the uh, the it sounds funny saying this, but the characteristics of the characters. So, like you said, him, Edward Norton's character being so dumb that he forgets all the other stuff that that he's done, like. Talking about him having the car the same night that he kills the sister, um, him not being able to like really hide the the the, uh, the envelope, him not clearing like basically him not cleaning up his footsteps like on the way of him trying to trying to do this. Like to your point, you like you really gonna have a murder mystery two weeks after you kill someone like that's that's wild. That's not. That's like a different you, type of arrogance of, yeah. they ain't gonna catch me. They yeah. ain't thinking like I'm thinking. And you even, and like, even for like, like, uh. The override button? Not the override, but for the, the, the main character, Andy. For her. No, no, no well. Oh, Andy, Andy? Andy? The, yes. For uh, Blanc to say like, Andy wasn't worried about you so much that she wouldn't even think that you would put something in the drink. Mm -hmm. So like. The characteristics of the characters stayed consistent throughout the mystery, which is like, it's really good. I didn't. That was one thing I was gonna be kind of nervous about. I didn't think this one was, you know, when they do sequels, that's really like the first one's really, really good, mm -hmm. and it's like, how can you top it 
And they did. I know. Like I, I really it's... like this one. And I'm I already thinking this. like I want to rewatch it like already right now and be like, damn, how did I miss that? Yeah. It, I really thought I, I didn't miss that. The they they did a really good the job at, 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 at oh. I'm like, it looks like it's Agatha. Claire. Her name is Agatha. <laughs> Right. Which one do you think? You think this one is which one? But the first one or the second one? I really like the first one, but I really like this. One. I, they I threw like in the, the twin telenovela kind of like you said. I like the first one, but I really enjoyed this one. I I, I, I enjoyed both. Yeah. It's hard. This but, one was satisfying. But I like satisfying. more than the first one. Uh, I'm out the scene. Of her. No, this, no, yeah, you're right. This one is a little bit more satisfying. It's satisfying to see the come up in, in the first one. It was like okay. The first one, if you haven't, if you haven't seen the first one, we react to the first. One. But go, go watch the first one. But I ain't seen them. In in the first, I'm about to reveal. Oh. In the first one, um, it was just because I, I I did rewatch it. But it's it's you did? sad. It's sad when you find out that he wasn't given the wrong dose. Mm -hmm. That to me was the big like, ah mm -hmm. damn! Like he ended up killing himself anyways, and he didn't give himself. Yeah. He didn't. She didn't give him the right, uh, the wrong dose. So that that to me is like the big like you know dang. In this one, the big thing was like him coming back and burning the hammer. I mean, uh, burning the napkins. Like ah dang. And then for your point, you like you still have the tape, right? The tape. And I she would have been recording thinking, that conversation. You know, I was thinking like, oh, okay, she did say up. the tape. Okay, maybe it pops up, but it just never did. But her notebook saving her life. Yeah, and I think that's. I think. I thought of a uh, bringing down the house. Mm -hmm. I think that's a. Um, Honest. No, that's a that's a stereotype for the for for these types of movies, right? Something saves the person, and then it gets revealed at the end. Hey, yo, <laughs> no, his real ass commitment to He said, yeah, I was I'm assuming good. that's some hot, hot sauce. Like, it was. You didn't hear him coughing when he was like, oh, <laughs> shit. Like, right. that was a bad idea after, like, it was quick thinking, but damn. The stereotype in the, I know you guys don't, I know you don't remember it that much, but the stereotype that would have been a stereotype in the first one is when... She saved that um that one lady what, and she in was, the basement. Yeah, she was like, You did this. When when we thought she said you did this. Yeah. Remember they sent her to the to the hospital and there was like, Oh, she's still alive, she's ready to do your confession and then she was about to throw up because it was a lie. Like the stereotype would have been her being alive so they can get the the statement in the um in the hospital room. But she was end up being really dead. So like that's what I'm saying. They didn't really have too many stereotypes. I know you guys don't remember it in the first one. Somewhat. I, but I don't remember. Like, there wasn't too many stereotypes in the first one. It was just like a really good like mystery. Mm -hmm. And this one, it, it was still a really good mystery, but it had some stereotypes, which I, it didn't really bother me. But because it was like, it was just so good. Like where you think there was going to be a stereotype, there wasn't. And then when you didn't think there was going to be a stereotype, there wasn't. So that's why I like this movie was good. They gotta keep these going though. I heard there's gonna be another one. Oh cool. Really? Mm -hmm. Why did they choose to put it on Netflix? The first one wasn't on Netflix, was it? No. It went to theaters, right? Yes, but everything this is like pre pandemic. Oh uh, yeah. That's they true. did have that that's true. the pandemic in this one. Yeah, that's true. And it played a role. I think it's really cool that they put these on the streaming services. Yeah. Like it, there's a I think there's a space for big movies on streaming services, like Prey being on uh, Hulu. I, and then somewhat, this, you know, I do enjoy the movie experience. Oh yeah, one hundred. But I do like the option to be able to watch it at home. That was our reaction to Glass Onion, a Knives Out mystery. I will say I like Knives Out as a title better than Glass Onion. But yeah, at first I was like, what? Why is it called Glass Onion? Right. Um, I'm thinking Shrek. Uh, thank what? you to our fifth onions, have layers, ogres, have layers. Okay, thank you to our 15,428 subscribers at the time. Sorry. Sorry. Damn, Sorry. bitch. You didn't hear me. Go, go, go. Okay, okay. Ready to go. Thank you to our 15,428 subscribers <laughs> at the time of this recording. Thank you to Trace Jones, Julia Guillaume, Daniel Estrada, RLG, Joel Mayberry, Shane White, and our patron, 
Get a wigs with Get it. my wigs. Get my Get wigs. Get a wig. Get my wig. Thank you for being a patron. Thank you for being a patron. I tried. I said, get a wig. <laughs>